Good morning, beautiful people. Zena, come. Hope you guys are doing fine. Thank you so much uh, for joining me today. As you can see, we just woke up. I've been wanting to do this video like since like forever. But no time, no space with this one. Hey. So let's just do it like this. Um, anyway, this is a video. Um, this is a video that has to do with talking about uh, a customer service related job in uh, in Sao Paulo, Brazil for Nigerians. Okay. Um, yeah. So I I I applied for this job uh, through an organization. And many months later, they got they got back to me. I don't know if you can hear me, but they got back to me. The 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 the, the company itself got back to me, and I was invited for an interview, online interview. So, this job is a customer service job for Nigerians. Okay, they need Nigerians to do this job because you have to be communicating and directing or explaining something to I think Nigerians maybe online or something of that nature so um um so uh i the name of this organization i used to say it on this channel there are lots of organizations here in brazil that helps immigrants if you follow up my videos you would have seen a couple of my videos me talking about all these all these organizations okay so these organizations will help you to settle down in Brazil. They will help you. You can learn Portuguese for free. They can help you get a job. They can help you apply for your asylum. They can help you with so, so, so many things. I have mentioned them a couple of times on this channel. If you follow me back to back, you will understand what I'm saying. Uh, so this organization, I went to them then when I was trying to see if I, 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 I could work. Their name is uh, Misao Miss, Miss Paz, okay, Peace Mission. Misao Paz in, in Portuguese, but Peace Mission in English, okay. They are into immigration stuff, uh, immigrant stuff. They help you, they, they guide you, they assist you with jobs, all this type of things, okay. So I went to them then. Uh, so, but anyway, the company got back to me in recent times and I decided to, uh, I went for the interview anyway. But the reason I went for the interview, a couple of Nigerians was online as well. We all did the interview together. And the next day, I think, or the same day, I got a message that I have been employed to do this job. But my thing is this. Why I am not going to be moving forward with this job is because I have health issues, okay? So um, I looked at my health issues. I look at the fact that I'm always going for medical appointments. And I'm like, okay, if I start this job, how am I going to always take permission to go for my uh to go for my uh, uh, uh appointments so it didn't make sense to me i was just playing around with the job thing i really didn't know if i wanted to work i want to work okay but with my health conditions right now i need to finish everything all up if i need surgery i finish the surgery i rest i get better then then i go back to work so that's the reason i'm not moving forward with this job okay so i have communicated this with this woman unfortunately she was very sad but it's okay she was very very sad <laughs> i'm still on my night girl anyway that's my situation that's my life uh, because if i don't do it like this now there is like i don't have time and um, this baby will not let me rest anyway so um uh so uh, just imagine i have uh, uh, an appointment for an endoscopy in just a few days time now imagine me going for the training and because the training you will train for 15 days before you start the main job then imagine me telling them already i'm going for an appointment for my for my medical appointment imagine so it's it's uh it's it's how will i put it now i know it's distracting right so it's better just to finish up with my issues say good morning hello so it's better to finish up with all everything i have to do and then get better and then go to work so that's why i'm bringing this job opportunity right here so that any nigerian can try it out and see if they get lucky as well okay so uh there are different timings to this job you can choose any time that you like uh that suits you they'll give you i think three different timings and again the, um, they are offering 1800 reals i don't know if there's transportation or food i think you need to talk to them about that so and uh, also it's just customer service based you'll be talking to nigerian clients 
uh, uh, communicating with them, helping them with one or two information here and there. I think it has to do with um, uh, gaming, football gaming or something of that nature. So anyway, that is what the job is all about. So they will train you for 15 days and then subsequently you start working the salary is not bad if you ask me if you if we look at the situation in brazil it's not bad at all so to get this job um i would want to pass on to whoever is interested nigerians please because that's what they required that's what they requested for i would like to pass on to whoever is interested um the the, the whatsapp number of the HR woman that was communicating with me. I don't know if it's right to do this, but that's the very reason I'm not going to be plastering her number here. If you need this, kindly send me a message on my Instagram. I will forward the number to you so you can try your luck. I told you that uh, you soon go to school, okay? Um, your water is uh, boiling. Uh, my heater is bad, so I need to boil water to, to shower her to go to school. Anyway, um, so uh, what was I even saying? What was I saying? So, uh, if you need uh, this information, just send me a message on my WhatsApp, uh, on my Instagram. <laughs> I'll send you. I don't want to put her number here so that it's not uh, somebody's private number is not everywhere on the internet. So, like I said to you, I got this job through an organization called Missile Paz Peace Mission. Okay, you can also go there to submit your CV for any potential future jobs. Okay, I'll put your name somewhere there for you to see. Put your address in my description box below so you can also approach them to help you at any time for anything for immigration work, citizenship, um, seeking asylum. They will just help you generally. Okay, so thank you so much for watching. We need to hurry now. Luciana needs to go to school. Luciana. So Luciana needs to go to school and um, I'll see you in my next video. Send me a message on Instagram and definitely I will reply. Ciao, ciao, everybody. Luciana, say bye. Uh -huh. She's saying bye bye to you guys. <laughs> bye. Bye. Yes, say bye. Thank you. She's saying bye bye. <laughs>